is so bombshell like it's not even funny so this hair and that i'm rocking is from a aliexpress company called ali moda hair i want it m-o-d-a moda hair and um this is their peruvian straight with a matching frontal as well as you guys can see and I did something a little bit different than I usually do with my straight hair that I did here, which was I cut a lot of layers into it, okay? So, as you guys can see, it is a lot of volume going on. I feel like Masika low-key. Like, I feel like, hello, Hollywood. Like, hello, hello, Hollywood. <laughs> um, but what I did was I just cut a lot of layers here in the front so that I can get all of this here on the side, which is very bombshell, very guest girl like, you know. Um, just something that was different that I wasn't used to. Now, I've been knowing how to do this layered look for the longest time. I guess these glasses will work, right? The longest time, but the thing that I don't like about this look is the fact that you have to cut a lot of hair on. Okay, just as a side note, I have in five bundles of hair, okay? Five. <laughs> and it doesn't look like five because the amount of hair that I had to cut in order to get this look. But I will say that um, because I did have five, I was able to do it. Usually I wear only, I wear about, well, usually about four bundles. So usually I, I'll, be, I'll be a little nervous to do this look because of that reason. I don't want to cut all my stuff and then my hair starts looking like super thin. But this was just enough that I was able to get the volume that I needed to keep so I can get all of this niceness. Now, I will say, off the rip, some of my favorite hair so far in 2017. Ali Moda did that because this hair is like everything. It curled. Guys, these curls have been in for a week, okay? A week. Now, mind you, I usually let my hair sit, but they have literally been like freestanding curls. It's been brush them out, put them on a mannequin head, and go about my day, okay? So, yes, when I first got it, I was wearing the straight because it is their Peruvian straight texture, but I decided, okay, well now, because it, it's just getting really hot, and I don't really know how much I would actually like to wear this hair if it was you know, in the summertime. So I'm like, well, the only way I could probably beat this with the heat is actually to curl it. So after about like a week or so of wearing it, I decided to go ahead and just chop it and I cut a lot off y'all. But worked out. I feel like Latoya Jackson now know that. So the frontal. Oh, now on my paper. Hold on. I about to say on my paper. I ain't got no damn paper. They sent me five bundles of 30 inch. Now, as you can see, my hair is nowhere near 30 inch. Like, it was long. 28 usually hit. It was long. I cut a lot off just because of the, the style that I was doing. This style would, in my opinion, require like eight bundles for it to be this long and then this voluminous for my liking, personally. So, I cut a lot of it off. Now, it says that my frontal... It says here that my frontal is a 13 by 4, but I'm almost certain that this is a 13 by 6 because a 13 by 4 would not come this far back. So maybe they accidentally sent me a 13 by 6. I don't know, but this is not definitely a 13 by 4, which is fine with me, girl, because, you know, it, it works. But, um, yeah, I, I'm obsessed with this. Like, legit obsessed with this look. And, you know... I ain't got no pants on, on the dance floor. What you playing? <laughs> I decided to keep the look that I had from the last video just because why not, you know? Um, as far as shedding goes, I got a little bit when I first received the hair, but it wasn't anything that was crazy. It wasn't excessive. It wasn't like, oh my God, I'm gonna die. It was just a little bit here and there. Now that I have gotten, you know, this hair, 
and I've cut it. I haven't got any more shading after I washed it for about the sixth time. I did notice, however, when I'm straightening this hair, I have to be a little bit heavier on the product than you normal because it seems like the straightening process takes a little bit more. That could have just been the fact that I had so many bundles in. Um, I don't know. I can't really pinpoint what the reason for that was, but after I actually put a little oomph into the, the, the flat iron, I was fine. Um, like I said, curling it has been great. I've used, you know, my nice um, heat spray. So I just like to use, when I flat iron, I like to use this spray. And then when I flat iron, with it, I like to use this spray, which is the the, the Tresemme that is the uh, number five. So it's the maximum hold. And it'll help you hold all your curls for a long period of time so that it'll stay like this no matter what you do. Your hair will actually stay in place once you take it off. When doing this, I use quite a bit of that particular hairspray just because of the fact that it's, going, it's, not, it's very light. So I want to use more than enough so that my hairs won't be sticky. As you can see, I can run my fingers through it and they're very bouncy. Everything is very voluminous. It moves. I don't have any issues with, you know, it getting snagged or it's like extra uh, sticky or anything like that. So in love with this. Legit in love. I, like, I don't even think I'm taking this off tonight. This is going to be, yeah, girl, I want to wake up like this. Come on, Beyonce. You know she had a twin today. So as far as the coloring process goes with this, I don't see why not you couldn't color this hair. Um, it didn't give me no issues when I did my strand test with it. I just don't think I would do, this is another one of those hair that I don't really necessarily think that I would do it as far as blonde goes, like the 613-ish color. But if you want to do like something like a brown or a copper, yeah, or you want to lighten it just to put another color over it, then I don't really see an issue or a problem with that. So overall, Ali Moda, you guys definitely get a nice A minus for me from me because of the coloring. I just don't know what's going on there. Um, again, I after I did that one review where I did Cruella Deville, I just feel like all hair should be able to go to 613 with no problems. And if it does, then you get you you, you know you get a little gray for me. I'm just saying though. But let me know how you guys like this, okay? Let me know. I'm gonna turn around because people like you don't have to turn around in your videos. Cool. We're gonna turn around so you guys can see the back. Yes, 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 just like that. So, let me know what y'all think about this look and I will catch y'all in my next one. I said, oh, please. Uh,